<laughs> you know, I mean, they're not your platform. Your platform is one of, you know, as we were talking about media, big three. There's a lot of things I, I don't do now that I see other people do. Nigga, nigga. It's about you. And this video quickly disproves this lie that Drake made. Uh, also uh, quickly looking for the broccoli. High key. Keep a horn on me. That the video starts. Uh, the hell is that about? Man, what the hell is, is this nigga about? talking to me right now? Wait, hold on. What's going on? I didn't No, no. I didn't say he's paying for views for the video. The song, I'm telling you, th there's proof that that it was bodied at first. Of course, like overall, it's primarily organic streams. The music video, I have no knowledge of it being bodied, and I don't think it's bodied. Truth be told, like it just is what it is. Biggest moment, biggest video. <laughs> oh, that completely shut down any allegation Drake made towards Kendrick, while also cleverly sneak dissing Drake throughout the entire video, and ultimately showing Drake he is not like us. He is not in the same league as Kendrick. Now, the video was directed by Dave Free, which is Kendrick's business partner from day one, and Dave Free also makes an appearance within the music video. Now, why this is so substantial is because in Drake's diss tracks against Kendrick, he was claiming that Kendrick's fiance Whitney was having an affair with Dave Free and that they actually have a child together that this son of Kendrick is actually Dave Free's son and Kendrick said the whole time don't tell any lies about me and I won't tell truth about you and this video quickly disproves this lie that Drake made also quick looking for the broccoli high key keep a horn on me the video starts off with a snippet of a brand new song by Kendrick based yeah, so uh, th th that there is a uh, I can't play much of it as I said but um there's a new song that he's debuting here and, and, and I'll give I'll tell you what what I feel about this song number one and for everybody, like, uh, I hate that I have to do this, but this is, you know, listen, heavy is a head that wears a crown. You know what I mean? And it's okay. I'll t I, I understand. But I understand. Anytime I give Kendrick credit, they think I'm switching sides. Kendrick has not been my favorite artist ever in life, and he never will ever in life. That's just how it is. Drake's my favorite artist. However, I'm just not a liar. I can see, think, and I'm not here to try to pull a fast one on y'all because y'all could think as well. I would look crazy if I just denied reality. And I might have different opinions than you guys, but for the most part, I'm kind of going off, like, on an honest perspective. Now, let me just say this. And I guess I have to say that because I think some Drake fans want me to just be like, yo, yo, they'll, they'll compare me to DJ Head. With all due respect, DJ Head is is inside Kendrick's camp or whatever the fuck. Um, the, he ain't me. Okay? He's not me. So, um, you know, please don't compare me to DJ... Oh my God, who the... F don't compare me to DJ Head. Okay? And as much as I do like Drake, I do have to give Kendrick credit as well. So first and foremost, two things I noticed off the rip. If Kendrick pops out, I don't know how his music release schedule is going to be. Hold on. Who the hell is that? My Come on, Ed. Get it together. Come on now. Okay, sorry. All right. <clears throat> All right. Come on. Sorry. Get it together. Okay, so... So two things I know it's off the rip, right? Two things. Um, basically, I think Kendrick stylistically might be taking up a new type of wave. And this particular wave that he's taken up is definitely 100%. It's it's kind of reminding me of 2017, a year that I thought he dominated. This kind of like, you know, um, like he's rapping more up-tempo than this normal, like, yeah, of course he's always lyrical, but it's kind of like meant for club shit. And if Kendrick kind of pops out on that, I do think that Kendrick might have this shit jump in if he releases. I don't know if he's dropping nothing. Um, I think one is only supposed to assume that. Um, what the fuck is going, bro? <laughs> bro, what is it, boy? Hey, hey, Ag is going through it right now, boy. This boy, this nigga nervous than a motherfucker. Boy, boy, he going through it over there, man. He don't know if 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 he should stay on his knees, if he should get on all fours. He don't know if he should get. Missionary position. He don't know what to do. He don't know if he should give or take. He just all over the place right now. Pause. No diddy. Right. He don't know what to do. Hey yo, what the oh, fuck? Pause. What? Pause. Pause, pause bro. Mm -mm. He don't know if he should be on his knees on all four. Should he stand up? Hmm. Watch out now. Now, now, Drake is probably texting you right now. Hey, I, ju I just heard your first, hey, nigga, I'm about to cancel. I'm about to X you out of the uh, Christmas list. All right, now, I told you I just added you to the OVO Christmas list. You was about to get your package. I think Drake is texting him right now saying, uh, you, all right, enough is enough. Now, I'm, I'm going to need you to follow the script. Follow the script, boy. Read the script. <laughs> I think Drake is texting him right now. Read the script. Read the script I gave you, boy.
Because they're both your goons. Y'all ain't shit. <laughs> Yo. Yo, y'all probably think... All right, hold on. Oh, my God. Yo, y'all probably think that... uh. Drake is texting you right now. Appreciate you with that too. Drake. Drake. Zone fanfic super shattered one dollar and ninety nine cents. It's probably his lawyer on the phone monitoring. <laughs> Embarrassed smiley face. Yo, boy. Hey. <laughs> Appreciate that two dollar donation, boy. That nigga is nervous as hell, boy. Everybody hitting him up. Drake hitting him up. His lawyer hitting us up. His manager hitting us up. Read the script. Read the script, boy. <laughs> Y'all said Drake texting me, nah, brother. <laughs> yep, he is texting you. Yo. <laughs> so, um, okay. Here's the point. When I when I heard this little I'm track, I'm stargazing. Life goes on, honey. Hold my baby. Hey, like Kendrick getting back on some high tempo, like, you know what I mean, kind of bop type of vibe. I think that's good for him. But this is the first time I'm really seeing Kendrick. Well, let me not say first time, but it feels like he's kind of definitely, especially off the Not Like Us track, he's leaning into the West Coast, which I think is amazing, right? It's, it's amazing. I think he, this is, you know, as much as I say, like, again, I'm giving my thoughts and I'm, and I'm like predicting. I think he's just going to dip, right? I think he's just going to, after this, he's going to dip. I could be wrong. I hope I'm wrong. But if he if he drops an album and consistently drops and he leans into the West Coast sound, I'm going to be honest with you, I'm going to have to sit here and salute that nigga because that's what it means to bring your coast back. Now, for the people on the West Coast who claim y'all hot, most y'all ain't hot, all right? Like, yo, the West Coast, we catch the fields for everything. Which I mean we not hot. Nobody knows y'all. Relax, okay? Um, I do. Whoa, whoa. Ag, you've been taking a lot of shots at, whoa. This another shot at the West Coast? Yo, he been taking a lot of shots at the West. Whoa, wait. We got to play that back. Is that more shots? Which I think is amazing, right? It's, it's amazing. I think he, this is, you know, as much as I say, like, uh, again, I'm giving my thoughts and I'm, and I'm like predicting. I think he's just going to dip, right? I think he's just going to, after this, he's going to dip. I could be wrong. I hope I'm wrong. But if he, could, if he drops an album and consistently drops and he leans into the West Coast sound, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to have to sit here and, Salute that nigga because that's what it means to bring your coast back. Now, for the people on the West Coast who claim y'all hot, most y'all ain't hot, all right? Like, yo, the West Damn. Coast, we got the Which I mean, we not hot. Nobody knows y'all. Relax. Okay. Damn. Damn, West Coast. How y'all feel about act just, just, just saying that y'all ain't relevant right now? He's saying that the West Coast ain't relevant. Damn. Shots fired. Damn. What's up, Timo, with the five dollar donation? Let's get it. Timo TV. Super shattered five dollars. So he's still gonna claim bots. This nicker basically said Mexico. Some of y'all get the joke exclamation yeah, mark. You better y'all. put some respect on the West. One hundred. Hey. One hundred. Well, well, um, from from what I'm hearing right now, Timo, it sounds like he disrespecting the West. Appreciate that five dollars, but it sounds like he low key disrespecting the West. Let's play that back. Appreciate the five dollars. Appreciate the five dollars. I don't, I don't, I don't think he putting respect on the West. Let's play that back. Appreciate Which I think it's amazing, right? It's, it's amazing. I think he. This is you know as much as I say like again, I'm giving my thoughts and I'm and I'm like predicting. I think he's just gonna dip, right? I think he's just gonna after this he's gonna dip. I could be wrong. I hope I'm wrong. But if he if he drops an album and consistently drops and he leans into the West Coast sound, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to have to sit here and salute that nigga because that's what it means to bring your coast back. Now, for the people on the West Coast who claim y'all hot, most y'all ain't hot. All right. Like, yo, the West Coast, we catch the fields for everything. Which I mean, we not hot. Nobody knows y'all. Relax. OK. Um. Nobody knows y'all. He said nobody knows y'all. He said nobody knows y'all on the West Coast, even though the West Coast is. Man, if it wasn't for the West, hip hop definitely wouldn't be what it is right now. Do you, man? That's hella disrespectful. He ain't giving the West no love. That's hella disrespectful for saying that nobody knows who the West is. Damn, that's hella disrespectful. Damn. Mm. 
I do think Kendrick has an opportunity to help platform the entire West if he leans into the sound that is traditionally West Coast. It takes a nigga like that to make that sound what people want, and then it'll, it'll have a trickle-down effect. Where Damn. Shot. Damn. Shots after shots. Is it happy hour? Oh, it must be happy hour over there in a academics house because it's shots, 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 shots. Shot. Everybody, shot, shots. Damn, it must be happy hour over there. Ooh, Damn, it must be happy hour. Damn. Woo, woo. Why you pulling like a bitch, ain't you? Trying to strike a chord, and it's probably... Drake! <laughs> Drake? Zone fanfic super shattered $1.99. Lawyer, here's your new script. Don't mess it up. Hey, boy, he is reading the script now. He is definitely reading the script now. He he throwing dirt on the West. I don't think that's, that's, that's what you should do, man. The West... Man, stop, man. Hey, I don't I don't condone what this man is saying. Sh salute to the West. You know what I mean? Y'all been doing it since 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 day one, man. So salute to the West. I respect the West. All right. I I love y'all. I love y'all culture. I love y'all people. Love y'all food. I love the weather. Love the beach. I, I love everything over there. All right. Shout out to the West, man. People will go to other individuals and be like, oh, okay, we're checking for this, and we're checking for this, and we're checking for this. That's kind of how it goes. You get what I'm saying? So th that was the first thing I noticed with um, um, this snippet, right? 